Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, please call me DNA. We are back with more Resident Evil Village. Uh, I have nothing to say, so let's get into it. Um, here we go, I guess. I'm kind of scared, to be honest with you. I unlocked it. Yay. You really are a tough one. But I'm tired of chit chat. Time to die. You can hear it, can't you? Someone's waiting for you. Oh no. Oh no. It's gonna be the airplane duty. Roto type. Proto? Proto. I don't know why I said Frodo. That's weird. Um, use a cheap turb... Bop rope engine? But he's impossible to control. All he does is charge too much power output from the reactor. Completely invincible head on. But the dumbass managed to chop his own damn arm off on the propeller. Also, issues with overheating from running for long periods of time. Inclusion, a complete failure. Sounds like the dude I'm gonna be, uh... Faced up against, so yay! Oh, mom. Hold me. Hold me. Oh, oh, oh. I don't have time for this bullshit. Out of my way. Oh. Oh. That should have fucking killed me, bro. Hey, yo, what's that? Uh-oh. Now stay down. Oh. That was easier than I thought it would be. <laughs> Poor dude. He didn't ask for this. Am I back at the... No. Cigar. Miranda is abom- ab abominable. What is with these giant fucking words? That I've never heard before. Her deceit knows no bound. Or merely a bunch of failed could do experiments to her. I was just lucky I had more affinity to the stuff than the other poor smucks in the village. So she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive her for what she did to me. That crazy bitch has never been right in the head. She can't see a different see a difference between experiment and family. Miranda didn't just change my body, she took my dignity. If I don't kill her, then my life will never be my own. Still, she may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She can turn into anyone using the Megamancy? The trick is that Brat Rose, if I could access her power, then maybe. Speaking of, the kid's dad, Ethan, has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. What? Why am I special? What's going on with you, Ethan? You got some secrets? Oh. 
Hello. Uh. It's too quiet to be true, you know? Cargo bay. What's happening? Um. Oh. Eisenberg? Are you with me? I like him like he's a fucking ghost or something. Oh shit. I keep accidentally pushing those buttons. I don't like using them. What the? Sound like I'm gonna cry. Oof, the screen tearing. I'm trying to listen to see if I hear any of those, uh... Goats, but I don't think I do. There's so many noises, I don't know what's what anymore. Oh shit! I told you to leave it alone, Ethan! You are in the way. What do you care, Chris? You killed my wife, you son of a bitch! You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. What the fuck? It was Miranda. What? She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. See, hmm. she also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! Why don't you fucking tell me right away? Because I knew you would want to be involved. And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Why us, Chris? What the hell is going on? All right, Ethan. All right. I guess I owe you an explanation. Hand me that wrench. Long story short, oh. Miranda's fucking insane. And this village, 
All these monsters and freaks, this is her life's work. Some sort of crazy experiment with the mold. The mold. Like Louisiana. God damn it. All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything! That might not be true. No way this guy Take built this, this shit. <laughs> My men sent those pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda. Keep looking. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go! Relax. My men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get anything. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. Oh. I will stay down here and finish planting explosives. You take that elevator. I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Together. Damn straight we will. And when I find Miranda, she's a dead woman. All right, Ethan. Then you take this and do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. Oh? You can't turn back now. We're like fucking in it. This up here is like that. All right. Why did that take so long? Metal polymer composite, huh? Time to fight fire with fire. Sounds so old. I'm coming, Rose. Oh god, this feels horrible already. This is so cheesy. This is like the worst part of the fucking game, I swear. Oh my god. This just doesn't feel right. I see. You're like a goddamn cockroach! You oh. think you can take me on? Fine! This will be my wound before I kill you, bitch. Let's settle this. Man, a man. Your curse will be another addition to my arm! <laughs> What's wrong, Ethan? <laughs> so this is the power of Father Love. I feel like I'm playing a weird, like... I level of Pac-Man. Like the PlayStation 2 game. Like the metal, the ghost suit. Ah! 
Fan. The clock is ticking, Ethan. Play that door. Oh! There's something wrong with the game! There's floating metal! Hello? Ethan? I heard explosions. What the hell happened? I dealt with Heisenberg. Now I'm gonna find Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. It's too dangerous. Wait there, you hear me? Ethan? When did I have a phone? Rose. Ethan! It's Miranda! Ethan, That's not your baby. Mia? What? Our child. She's so important, isn't she? That's not Mia, either. She's everything to me. <laughs> and mine to me. With Heisenberg gone, you've lost your lead. What are you going to do? I don't know, but I'm saving Rose. You'd never know, do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor. Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Fucking told you, dumbass. Enough. Remember Evelyn and her power over them all? Rose is her successor. No. Rose is Evelyn's true, complete form. She will grow to fully control the masses. And I must have her! Fuck you, you crazy bitch! Calm yourself. Rose will be saved. The Mega My Seat catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. She's my child, not yours! 
Where are you? Show yourself! Why did Rose come to be? <gasps> Was it because lady. of her parents? And you are truly a special case. But I've learned all I can from you. Your worth as a lab rat has run out. Miranda! You coward! Come on and face me! Don't worry. Your death will come quick. Ew. You will join the Mega My Seeds records. I will make sure to Bruh. sample your blood for later. That's my heart. <laughs> Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete. How am I not dead? And I will become her true mother, bound for eternity in blood. <laughs> Uh, if I saw that, I waited so long, but dreams really can come. True. What the fuck? Vessel or not, I can't wait to see my true child again. Am I dead? Dead? What's happening? I'm confused. Chris is gonna repair me with a metal heart. Captain, I've confirmed the death of Ethan Winters. I wasn't able to retrieve the body, but I've recorded evidence. Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. Who knew she could fake being a corpse? Oh. <laughs> Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. And she is not gonna get away with it. God damn it, when does it end? What's that, sir? The mission? All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. Three years too long. Go get her, Captain. The squad's ready for you. BSAA got here already. They didn't waste any time. Mission adjustment? No, it doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Yes, okay. K9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. Roger that. I'm on it. Chris is so it's cool. Since we fought together, Captain. When was the last? The desert? Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. But thanks to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard she turn herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at either. Spooky. Man, I can't believe Ethan is like dead dead, bro. What about the baby? This is interesting. Map? I don't have a map. Oh shit. The village is like fucking on fire. Hey Alpha, look at this. The 
SAA. They've gone too far. <sighs> Christ. It looks pretty rough down there. How are you planning on reaching the objective? First, we're gonna have to take that thing out. I've got your back, boss. Let's get to work. Everyone watch for hostile bioweapons. Roger. Make contact with a group of hostile bioweapons. There's more than we can Watch out. Oh, I see. Okay. I thought it was- I didn't think it was that kind of gun. Western route is clear. Moving out. Roger that. BSAA craft spotted. Two guards. <laughs> I can take them. Don't get cocky. This is the farmhouse. These vine things aren't gonna touch me, are they? Large the mold may be releasing infectious particulates. Keep your masks on. Hey, boss, it's me. I'm at the location prepared for support fire. Might be a minute. Roger. Tundra here. Leaving some supplies in one of the houses, Captain. Help yourself. I'm a captain. What? This game has uh, taken to a whole new fucking level. I'm sad Ethan's dead, though. There's so many. Ugh. Yeah, baby. Legit jumped on top of me. I've reached the target location. Damn, this is big. All right, Lobo. Marking the target. Roger that, boss. Just a minute. 
There's a swarm headed that way. This is crazy. Damn it! What am I getting attacked by? BSA guys are engaging the bioweapons. You're right, Captain. They must be after the Megamyce C2. How many are there? I know they're okay. They're coming from the mold. It looks like it's about to collapse. Give me a break. Hold your horses. It's the reloading. Watch your perimeter, guys. Oh my god, my game's freaking out. I'm reloaded. Where should I point next? Damn it, these things are using weapons. I'm sure they're thinking the same about you. going from here. Through here? Yeah? Yeah. I found a way down. I'm going in. The rest of you stay back. Captain, I compared the mold at the village with a sample from the bakers and uh, there's no sign of the genome editing we saw in the E-series. The stuff originated here. I don't think this is doing anything. I'm overhead, boss. Good. I'll signal with the locator. Give a guy a break. Bro, he's got me trapped. Killed him. I'll keep going. The rest of you stay above ground. Oh, okay. <laughs> She saw any further use for her. 
I don't get any of this. How did Miranda even know Rose exists? A moldy little bird told her, maybe? We can figure that out later. Focus on the plan. Oh. It's I the heart. It. It's the Megamycete. Oh. Okay. Grace is so cool. Alpha the squad. <laughs> I've located the Megamycete. So now we can end this mess after all. It is awesome. About damn time. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. Roger that. Standing by. Fuck, we're gonna Captain, finish the I fucking game of it. At the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give the order. I know it's too late now, but we really should have told Ethan the plan. There wasn't time. We didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Yeah, Chris, now Even Ethan's so, dead. You should have told him. Yeah. These noises are not it. I can't, I don't have a map at all anymore, apparently. This must be Miranda's lab. Subject name, Salvatore Morella. More, more, Mori. Mori? Yes? Uh, could you affinity low, brain functioning, surprisingly low. The Kadu has caused drastic changes to internal organs, transforming them into organs similar to fish-like gills and a swim bladder. Okay, another subject with irregular cell division causing him to transform into a giant fish. The subject is unable to control this transformation. Too many defects in unfit vessel for Eva. Who the fuck's Eva? Name Alcina Dimitri. That's the giant lady, right? Uh, could you affinity most favorable brain functions normal? Regu regeneration rate is incredibly fast. The subject can heal any external wound within seconds and grow her nails into claws in mere moments. Rapid regeneration also means an increased body size. Uh, due to uh here Theory blood disease, the subject must ingest human flesh and blood on a regular basis to maintain reg red re regeneration properties. Fuck. Um, I sub suspect that if the subject's regeneration is not properly balanced, then she may mutate uncontrollably in unfit vessel for Eva. Okay. Carl Eisenberg. Incredibly favorable. Brain functions normal. Has electric organs similar to the electric ray. Narc. Uh, uh, um, no. These electric <laughs> organs are connected to the subject's nervous system. Can therefore pass and control electricity throughout the entire body, allowing control of magnetic fields, which is used to move metal. Splendid specimen, but still not an. Still an unfit vessel for Eva. Is Eva the- e Evil. Is Eva the child that she wants to bring back? Uh, Donna Benevento. That's the puppet lady. Favorable. Normal. Although, several mental illness. Severe mental illness. Sorry. Um, physically, she is no different from a regular human. However, she can- secrete a signal producing substance which controls plants infected by the mutacete. I'm sorry, I'm not getting any of these words correct. 
When humans absorb the pollen from a particular flower, she can cause them to have hallucinations. However, she is mentally underdeveloped and has divided her kadu among her dolls in order to control them from a distance. An unfit vessel for Eva. I see. So, uh, where's Rose's book? I don't know what that is. Dear Miranda, my deepest apologies for not meeting you in person. I would love nothing more than to visit your quant, quant village once more. However, I am incredibly busy. Then again, I suppose for an um, immortal woman such as yourself, you no longer remember this poor half-dead medical student in the snow. I have always cherished the real revelations I came to fi 15 years ago when I studied in your village. I was inspired by your research to think one could transform a human by infection with them with an organism uh, positively visionary. I knew that with that knowledge I could achieve my own vision for the next step in human evolution. Even after two world wars and humanity on the cusps of another my conviction never wavered. I realized, however, through the many nights of intellectual talks you and I share, that your convicts differ, differed from mine. You hope to bring back a single dead person while I aim to change the world. Your experience on the mold would not have aided me in my endeavors to achieve an explosion infection. I thought a virus would be more effective. This is why, my dear, I have to leave you. I still regret never telling you goodbye. My apologies for remencing. I actually have news that I thought might please you. I have found the key to evolution, the progenitor, a virus found in Africa. I plan to start a company with friends and colleagues dedicated to the virus research. I will call it Umbrella, just like the symbol in the cave that we spoke about. I am one step closer to making my vision a reality. I hope you will be able to achieve your goal someday, too. You taught me so much, and for that, I will be forever in your debt. Sincerely, your lifelong student, Oswell E. Spencer. Spencer. Here. No way. Who the fuck, Spencer? Look at all this wood. I don't know who any of these pictures are. Eva. It's been 100 years since I lost you to a Spanish flu. I was so powerless back then, but now, now I can bring you back to life from the megavesty. Ah, uh, no. Um, I had to test your new vessel's regenerating abilities. I took her apart and revived her in the uh, re regulator, the giant chassel. All that is left is to merge her with the thingy. The ceremony can finally begin. After I lost you, I was so stricken with grief that I wandered into a cave to die. I so wanted to be with you again, and that's when I found it, the Mega Mansi. Completely by accident. When I touched the black substance, my mind was overcome with knowledge. The Mega Mansi breaks down and absorbs the consciousness of those who have perished. I know that if your consciousness was in there too, then there would be a way to bring you back. I just need the right vessel. When I returned to the village, I implanted the villagers with mold from the Megamancy. That way I can control them, experiment on them. I have experimented on hundreds of people just to find you the perfect vessel. I don't think this dead baby is gonna appreciate how Miranda killed all these people for her. One life isn't worth that many, surely. Um, I even tried to increase the efficiency of finding a vessel by creating a parasite I called Kudu. Yet, none of my experience came to fruit... fruit... Chin? What? Uh, <laughs> there were some, like Alcina, 
who were close to being perfect, but most turned into lichens. I was once approached by an organization who said they would assist me. I gave them some of the mold and your DNA, but all they created was another defect. Evelyn. Evil Evelyn. Then again, not a complete failure. I learned of Rose thanks to them, and I knew she she would be the perfect vessel. There was some interference, but I was able to verify her stability. Now my research is finally complete. Eva, I have waited too long to see you again. Well, this mother sounds fucking insane. And I get it, you're a mom, but like, you can't be doing this to people. I hate how I can't see a map. Dude! Show me your hands! It's Mia! Umbrise, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right now? Still at the ceremony site. Whatever she's doing, she's staying put. God damn. It really is you. I'm glad you saved me. Why are you here? I was caught in Houston experiments. Wait, did you say Mia? Mia Winters? Am I gonna have to kill her? Flesh. What's the situation? This whole up there? family is gonna be dead. Going on. Nothing we can't handle. Don't get distracted. Stick to the mission. I'm headed to the ceremony site. Wait. You can't leave me here. You promised, damn it. You said that you would keep us safe. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything. And I didn't care. So long as we were together. So you tell me, where is my husband? Where is my daughter? And Ethan's dead. He's gone. That's so sad. I couldn't save him. But I can save Rose. Could you imagine your husband's just fucking dead? Legit, his heart got ripped out and squished. It's not safe here after all. What do you mean he's gone? He's dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No! It's so sad. It's so sad. I tried to keep this a secret, but... You don't understand how special he is. So Ethan's not dead. How does she know everything? Who is Mia? How does she know this shit? How does she know? Oh my god. Fuck Mia, man. I don't give a shit about Mia no more. What's going on? Yeah. Uh, uh, the fuck? So there? Uh, it's cold. How am I alive? I have no fucking heart. How did I get here? God, it's freezing. Uh, uh, this shit, my body. Uh, Ethan, you got your heart torn out. <laughs> like, how are you even mentally okay right now? Like, you watched it. You're so dumb. Okay. <gasps> no. Is that the child? Oh. How are you here? Who the fuck's Evelyn? You're dead. I think I dead. missed this from the last game. I mean, Miranda. She. No. I still have to save Rose. Rose? <laughs> it wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What are you saying? 
I can still... See? Miranda didn't kill you. You mean you didn't think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt? Remember? I don't remember, but thank you for showing me. <laughs> Three years ago, the Baker House. You were murdered by Jack. You died there three years ago. Who is the Jack? That, that's, that's impossible. No way. You shouldn't even be able to walk around. Quit messing with my head. I should have played the you last game. shouldn't be walking. Screw <laughs> you! What You're a vampire, Ethan. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. I, 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 I did all that. <laughs> Rosa. Mia. I. What is going on, bro? on for way too long <laughs> it's great it's cool and all but like holy shit I, I will save Rose. oh here we go just a couple seconds too long <laughs> At last, he awake. Dude, is that Duke? Where am I? My carriage, Ethan. You were having a nightmare. Duke? Your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. But to think Miranda would show herself. How long have I been out? Not long till dawn. Duke, I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assumed as much and I'm already on the way. Why am I going Should to the lady who murdered me? Thank you. <laughs> but Ethan, are you sure of this? Your body is, well, falling apart. <sighs> yes. Foolish of me to ask. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> I'm Miranda. Yeah, I can't quite answer <laughs> that. We're here. I owe you one. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? What's happening? I'm so confused. Oh. Yeah. I have to be. Let's go. I gotta go. Alright guys, I'm gonna leave this video here. It's been going for an hour now. I really want to finish this game, but I don't want it to... 
drag on for like two hours long in this last video. So we're gonna wait, hold off, and put the last hour in the next video. So anyway, if you want to see that, please give me a thumbs up. Um, subscribe to support, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!